Hello everyone, this is Pamela with My Thrifted Life. Welcome, welcome. And today I am coming before you to do a tablescape in my kitchen just to show you how I had bought a lantern um, in my last haul. So please go check it out um, from Hobby Lobby. And um, I was going to put it in my family room. However, I decided to do a tablescape with it. So um, please stay tuned for that. And also having those snacks during the holidays. Um, we did, my daughter and I did a charcuterie board. So please stay tuned for that as well. I just wanted to say happy holidays to everyone. Just stop by and say happy holidays and just share with you a couple of snacks that you can have again around the holiday. So um, I do want to thank all of my subscribers. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe. And um, please comment below of what you think of my tablescape, um, but also the charcuterie board. Um, also comment on that as well and what you're eating during the holidays. So please let me know. Um, please stay tuned. Have a great one. All right, so let's get started. So here I have a piece of material that I bought from Hobby Lobby. My intentions were to use it as pillows or to make pillows um, for my couch. Um, it's very pretty green, velvety, shiny material. I absolutely love it. Um, so I'm going to use this as my, going to use this as my table runner. And as you can see here, I am using my lantern. I showed this lantern in my last haul. I've already decorated with a beautiful tree and a deer. Absolutely love it. And I topped it off with green tassels to match the runner. I bought this at Hobby Lobby just to gift it for myself. It is absolutely beautiful. I love the base of it. Now these charges I've had quite some time. I bought them from Amazon. Um, I think they're called J. Um, I can't remember the name of them, but I absolutely love these antique looking chargers. Absolutely beautiful. Now these green plates are from Hobby Lobby. They were on sale 60% off, I believe, or maybe half off. I've had these for maybe a month or two. Um, absolutely love those green plates. They're actually fall plates, but I use them, the green, I love the green. And it can be used around the Christmas holiday. The gold and the clear plates are um, from Home Goods. I had them for quite some time, so I use those. These napkins are actually fall pumpkin napkins. I just folded them over. I love the, uh, the uh, gold that I've added to the napkins, so I just use these and a gold napkin ring. Absolutely love the look. So I absolutely love this look, so I will probably keep this up for the new year. Um, it doesn't take too much space. The um, lantern is very narrow, and if my family wants to eat at the table, they can just move the plates to the side. Absolutely love it. Tell me what you think. Please comment below. All right, so let's get started on our charcuterie board. So first I'm gonna lay down this parchment paper on this cutting board that I found at Ross. And um, because I'm not quite sure if it's food proof. So now I'm gonna be using some wheat thins. Very delicious wheat thins, very plain. I did not want the crackers to overpower the foods that I'm going to be using. So next I am using this sharp chatter white cheese. Um, it is very delicious and it already comes sliced, which is great. So my daughter and I wanted to use two meats on the tray. So first it's this prosciutto italiano, which is actually delicious. And also we are going to be using the smoked salmon. Oh my goodness, very delicious. Absolutely love it. And what I'm doing is just taking my fork and just rolling it and adding it to the tray. So 
So next we wanted to add some fruit. Um, so we decided to buy some red, uh, red grapes, which are absolutely sweet and delicious. You can also use sliced apples, um, strawberries, whichever you prefer as a fruit. So give that sweet and salty uh, mix. And I absolutely love that. So here I'm adding some little bowls that I have had already on hand. I added some black olives. I absolutely love black olives. Very nice. And I'm going to be adding some nuts. Um, for the first nuts, I added some pecans and, and also I'm adding some cashews. They're very, uh, very delicious. They are uh, roasted. Uh, both of them are roasted, so oh my goodness, that adds a lot of flavor. So again, like I stated, I like the salty, sweet taste. So here, Aldi's normally has uh, apricot uh, preservatives. However, they didn't have any. This is called a orange, sweet orange is what it's called. So I added that. Um, I remember going into a grocery some time ago, and they had the um, wheat thins. They had the goat cheese, which I just added just a moment ago, and they had the apricot preservatives. They, it was so delicious with the combination. So that's uh, part of my tray here. Absolutely love it. We added some glasses of orange juice and it was absolutely delicious. Um, so please comment below. Tell me what you have as a snack um, for the holidays. All right, that is all that I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching and have a blessed day.